after doing the um, the toad watch up on Stanley Road on the way home I noticed that we've got all these squashed newts in the road here. Now, last night when I came home and there was five freshly squashed newts. Um, so on my way back tonight um, we've already saved two. So, yeah. so far we've had about 150 toads and we've had a lot more frogs this year as well. And how long do you expect the migration to last? Well, they're changing over at the moment, so they, some of them are starting to come back, go back into the gardens, but there are still a few late ones going into the lake. So what advice can you give to people? What sort of, what, when do people need to look out for the, the newts and the toads um, crossing? Dusk time normally, yeah. Yeah, and they seem to stop by about um, 8 o'clock. So come out with a torch? Yep. And a bucket? And a bucket, yep. And pick them up and then where do you advise that people leave them once they've picked them up? Uh, it depends which way they're facing. Ah, oh, really? So they are literally crossing the road? Yeah. So if they're facing that way then help them over that side. If they're facing the other way then obviously help them back the other way. But the difficult Get thing is, the is when they're walking down the pavement. So I think the best thing is just to put it back in the, back in the lake again.